Kevin Pilecki, exciting game today, a win against Tennessee Tech. You had yourself five hits at the plate, five singles. Give us a rundown of a couple of those at-bats. Uh, well, no, it's good to have a breakout day like I did today. I've been struggling a lot recently, so, um, you know, I've been trying to work on it in the cage, and today I think uh, it paid off a little bit. Certainly the ninth inning was a wild one. Eight runs, you were hit by a pitch with the bases loaded during that inning. You were out on the base pass for a while. Give us uh, your perspective on what happened in that ninth inning. Uh, well, you know, it was good to see our offense put up a lot of runs like that. You know, um, recently our offense has kind of been struggling a little bit uh, later towards the game, so um, it, an eight-inning uh, an eight-run inning is always going to help a team, especially in the ninth inning, so it was nice to see that we did that today. So obviously you're the catcher behind the plate. Brad Schreiber, the starter today, had eight strikeouts, and Blake Mascarello, a huge strikeout in the seventh inning to end the inning with the uh, runners on the corners. What was working for Schreiber, and what was specifically about that at bat uh, for Mascarello? Uh, you know, Shrives had everything today. You know, his fastball was locating real well, and his uh, off-speed curveball uh, was dominant as usual. So uh, it's always good to have him out there. He's always consistent with this stuff, and it's always nice as a catcher to know uh, really what to expect uh, when he's throwing it in there. And uh, Blake had a great strike out there with the, the intentional walk uh, with their guy, and he just came in and, and shoved like he always does. So we, our pitching did a great job today. Thanks, Kevin. Good luck going forward. Thank you. Andrew Dixon, uh, exciting game today against Tennessee Tech. You guys win the rubber game of the series. And uh, even though you didn't start today, you had a big impact on the game, starting with a big catch in right center field on a ball hit to the wall. Take us through that play. Well, I knew the wind was blowing out. It been happening all game. Every time a fly ball went, it really carried out to right. So when, when I saw the ball up, I just turned and ran and found the fence pretty quick and just made sure it was still in the ballpark. Color. Now, when you hit the wall, uh, did you feel it... Uh, come loose at all in your glove or did you have it all the way? I feel like I had it all the way but I didn't really think about it. Though. Gotcha. Alright so ninth inning, eight runs go up on the board for Purdue. You let off the frame with a base hit and then you came up again and got a triple so a big inning for you and uh, exciting stuff. Give us your perspective on that big rally. Well when I came in the guy was kind of struggling throwing he was throwing balls up in the zone and he threw a couple balls to me and I knew he was he was going to probably come with a strike or it was going to be out of the zone and I, I trusted that I'd, I'd be able to notice if it was out so Throw right down the middle and I hit it. So uh, has it been a while since you've had the opportunity to get two hits in an inning like that? Yeah, definitely. It's been probably since high school. So, All right, congrats on a nice win. Good luck. Thanks.